Hello everyone. So today I thought I'll probably uh, do something uh, for fun. Now, this is of course the famous uh, Matrix <laughs> uh, screen uh, screen saver. It is not really a screen saver, but it is uh, running in the terminal. So there is one uh, really nice uh, utility called uh, uh, I, I found it actually recently, which is uh, called as uh, C Matrix. So if you look at the uh, the manual of uh, this uh, this particular utility, you can actually learn quite a lot about uh, various configurations that you can do with this particular utility. And to be honest, it is uh, of course a cool thing. There is uh, nothing um, and nothing to learn about uh, this uh, piece of software. I believe you can also write it yourself. I did try doing something long back many years ago. I think uh, Matrix movie came out in 1999, something uh, I think around that time, and uh, I was around that time I was learning uh, C, and I remember doing something similar, especially when you are writing code with C, and uh, especially when you are doing engineering in India, you are supposed to do those uh, uh, th th those uh, coding challenges where you have to uh, create some diagram like you know a tower or uh, various things but this is some doing doing something like this is not very really difficult uh, to be honest but now of course i thought i'll probably just use this program which uh, is quite convenient so today i thought i'll probably show you a few things and uh, if you look at uh, this particular uh, application all you need to do you just need to run this right and nothing nothing much but if you want you can actually pass a few arguments like if you pass uh, this uh, uh, argument which is hyphen b then uh, i believe it will only show capital letters of course this is uh, looking uh, only capital letters or okay so it says bold characters on but if you if you do capital b then i believe all the characters will be bold but uh, with hyphen small b it will also ensure that there are i believe bold characters along with normal non bold characters and uh, apart from this what you can also do you can you can also uh do something like uh, hyphen m where uh, instead of uh, different random characters i believe it will only display lambdas which i don't really think uh, is that nice i prefer the old one and uh, I was looking for this uh, speed which I found using hyphen u. So if you pass in hyphen u and if you pass in a number, let us say if you pass in 9, then the speed is of course very slow, which is too slow. But if you pass in 1, then it is really fast. So this is something really, really useful. And uh, you can change the color by the way. So if you do hyphen c and pass in the color, I'm looking at the manual, it says uh, green, red, blue, blah, blah, blah. So let us try red color. Red color is fine. Maybe, maybe white. White is also not bad. Yellow. So again, you know, nothing, nothing too complicated. It, it is actually quite configurable. I mean, you can do a lot of wonderful things. But you don't really have to type in these uh, arguments in the beginning. What you can also do, while this uh, application is running, you can actually uh, press few keys to change uh, things. For example, if you do something like uh, I, uh, I mean, without any, I mean, just press the key in the terminal. So if you press A, I think it will toggle the A synchronous scroll. I'm not really sure what exactly is happening here. I think uh, the length of, uh, I'm not really sure, but uh, there, it, it means something. And you can also do random bold characters. I guess I can press B. So yes, there are some random bold characters, but if you press Shift B, then it is only capital bold. Then you can also do something like uh, uh, you, you can adjust the speed if you press uh, zero, which is too fast, then nine, eight, seven, and maybe one. So I think I prefer six. It looks good. And uh, not only that, you can also change the color on the fly using uh, these uh, special characters. So if you press uh, exclamation mark, it, it will be a uh, red color then uh, at the rate is uh, green hash is yellow dollar is uh, blue i don't like the blue color it is a bit too blue 
for me and then uh, percentage for magenta magenta looks good and then there is uh, this uh, i keep forgetting the name of this character you know this cap thing i forgot the name i think uh, anyways so let us also try this uh, ampersand ampersand is for white and i believe hyphen or what is this i don't know how it works underscore okay so black doesn't work for some reason but anyways i think i prefer the uh, I, i like the green one green one looks really good and also the magenta magenta yes this one nice okay so this is this is all this is all i wanted to talk about today i i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today thank you very much bye bye